Hi there. Um, yeah, something else, something completely different. And that is actually uh, some old games on the uh, TRS-80. This is actually uh, being emulated. I don't have access to a real machine. Uh, but this was actually the first computer, the TRS-80, uh, was actually the first computer that I had access to back in the day. Um, we used them at, uh, at our school. So uh, yeah, let's go check out some of the games. So this is a game, uh, Asteroids, and uh, yeah, <laughs> it's called Supernova. So it says uh, enter for instructions and clear for the game. So enter for instructions. So a large meteor is 20 points, uh, RTOP, RTOP, okay, clear to start the game. Uh, one player. Whoops. So it's and it's trust. Whoops. <laughs> okay, I would I would have uh, totally different controls, but those uh, those were the. Uh, whoops. Oh man, this brings back memories. The system didn't have any fancy graphics, it didn't have any sound. So you basically were just... Well, it could produce sound. It, 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 it was able to produce sound through the, uh, to the tape drive, uh, to the cassette port, but... Uh, ah, there's even a... There was even an... Uh, what is it? Um, a spaceship. UFO. So let's uh, go to the next game, uh, Galaxy Invasion, and that's actually a, a shoot the flying aliens game. So um, enter for instructions. Why not? Breaking clear to abort the game. So very nice graphics. Clear to start the game. One player. So basically, probably have to move left and right, left and right with the cursor keys and just try to. So this 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 was programmed in assembly machine code. Uh, it was possible to uh, to run basic games as well, but <coughs> those were very slow. I believe the uh, TRS-80 uh, had a Z80 processor. Whoops. So, but not a bad game. I mean, <laughs> it's actually quite playable. Whoops, game over. Well, let's go for Armored Patrol. So it's a battle, st battle zone style tanks game. Uh, I for instructions. Your mission: find and destroy enemy crafts in your area. Ooh, forward is A, backwards is Z. Right turn. Gosh. So I guess it's four players that are able to. I really have no idea. Some of the. Oh well, let's. Uh, Check it out. Enter to begin. One player. Oh, look at that. It really is a, a, t a tank game, with even with uh, bullets and stuff. So actually, not bad, those graphics. Let's check out the Donkey Kong clone. Uh, one player. So this really is Donkey Kong. And it's kind of tough. I'm 
hoping to be able to to rescue Daisy. Yeah. So there's more levels in there. As you can see the It's a pretty, pretty solid game. I mean, it really, oops, it really plays like Donkey Kong. I mean, it doesn't look it, but it, it has the, uh, it really has the same fluid gameplay. I mean, it, it plays a lot better than it looks, really it does. So, uh, Eliminator, Space Defender. So this is a Defender clone. One. Oh wow, this really is, it even has the inertia, whoops, gosh, and it has the radar too. So we didn't have these games back in the day, what we did have actually, but we weren't allowed to play them. So basically this is uh, on par with, uh, oh look, I got a, I got a complete uh, wave. Basically, this is uh, pretty much on par with uh, what we uh, had on the. Uh, well, they even have the different enemies. What we had on the Odyssey 2, the video pack. Wow, cool. Till Gunner for the fleet. Wow, really, some. some Nifty animations. One player. Oh wow. So this is these are shooter shooting games. So I'm basically I'm defending. This really looks like uh, the spaceship from uh, Freedom Fighters and the Odyssey too. Even the explosions are looking similar. Wow. Pretty nice shooter. Yeah, and I guess a lot of people are used to Xbox and PlayStation. They probably think I'm insane saying that this is actually a nice shooter, but. Uh, Whoa! <laughs> okay, let's go check out Scarfman, which is a Pac-Man clone. Uh, okay. It's running a bit fast, but let's eat all the ghosts. So the layout of the uh, of the maze is a bit different. It's uh, it's a bit reminiscent of the uh, twenty six hundred version. <laughs> Let's not forget that. But it's a nice uh, it's a nice version. I mean, it's pretty playable. All righty. Okay, let's go see Sea Dragon. Some pretty nifty animations. Enter to begin. One player. Oh, cool. <laughs> There's some pretty nice shooters. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know that TRS-80 was such. A... So it's like it's 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 basically like. A... It's basically like a scramble. And then we have a 
the Zaxxon game, the official port. And you'll probably be pretty amazed if you, if you, if you see how the game plays. Pretty solid gameplay. I mean, the graphics are very coarse, but uh, it's all hair. Whoops. So, and I just love that, you know? This machine that actually just only has. Whoa. Game over. Cool. Cool. Yeah, I rule. <laughs>